Freeman a Herboski Roman III. Freeman Alponsa Herboski Roman III, born August 13, 1950s, an American educator, advocate, and mathematician. In May 1992, he began his term as president of the University of Maryland, Baltimore County Elmk, one of the 12 public universities composing the University System of Maryland. Herboski has been credited with transforming Umk into an institution noted for research and innovation. Under his leadership, Umk was ranked the hash one up and coming university in the U.S. for six consecutive years 2009-2014 by the U.S. News and World Report magazine. When the designation was retired, U.S. News and World Report began including Umk on its annual Most Innovative National Universities list. His research and publications focus on science and math education, with a special emphasis on minority participation and performance in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics STEM. Herboski is a co-author of the books Beating the Odds, Raising Academically Successful African-American Males 1998, Overcoming the Odds, Raising Academically Successful African-American Young Women 2001, Holding Fast to Dreams, Empowering Youth from the Civil Rights Crusade to STEM 2015, and the Empowered University, Chaired Leadership, Culture Change and Academic Success 2019. Herboski chaired the National Academies Committee that produced the report expanding underrepresented minority participation, America's science and technology talent at the crossroads. In 2012, President Barack Obama appointed Herboski to chair of the newly created President's Advisory Commission on Educational Excellence for African Americans. Publications have named him one of America's best leaders, one of the 100 most influential people in the world, and one of America's 10 best college presidents. In 2011, Herboski received the Carnegie Corporation of New York's Academic Leadership Award, one of the highest honors given to an educator. Early life and education. Herboski was born in segregated Birmingham, Alabama, the only child of his parents, both of whom were educators. His mother was an English teacher who became a math teacher, and his father was a math teacher who went to work at a steel mill. Frequently asked about the origin of his unusual surname, Herboski explains that he is the great-great-grandson of Eaton Herboski, a slave owned by and named for Polish-American slave owner Samuel Herboski. In a CBS television interview, Herboski recounted that he is the third Freeman Herboski. His grandfather was the first Freeman Herboski born a free man, as opposed to having to be freed. When he was 12 years old, in 1963, Herboski saw his friends reading for the Children's Crusade March for Civil Rights. He convinced his parents to let him join in as a youth advocate, but soon into the march he was swept up in a mass arrest. Birmingham's notorious public safety commissioner Eugene Bull Connor spat in his face and arrested him. When he was 19 years old, Herboski graduated from Hampton Institute with high honours in mathematics. During his matriculation there, he spent a year abroad at the American University in Cairo, Egypt. At the University of Illinois at Bonnet Champaign, he received his MA in Mathematics and four years later his PhD in Higher Education Administration and Statistics. Career at UMC um. was a relatively young school in the Baltimore suburb when Herboski arrived in 1987 as Vice Provost, then Executive Vice President and President in 1992. Over nearly three decades as President of UMC, Herboski gained a high public profile. Herboski emphasised STEM education and co-funded the Mayor Hoff Scholars Programme, aimed at promoting minority achievement in STEM fields. Under his leadership, Mo Black students earned bachelor's degrees in science and technology from UMF and from any other non-historically black university in Maryland, even College Park, which has three times as many students. Harboski was an advisor to President Barack Obama on higher education policy and was appointed by Obama to serve as chair of an advisory council on excellence in African-American education. He received an honorary doctorate from Harvard University in 2010. Herboski has announced that he will retire from UMC in the spring of 2022. Awards and honours Herboski has received, among other awards, membership to the American Philosophical Society 18th Annual Heinz Award in the Human Condition Category Arts Medal 2020 Black History Month 2017 Honorary, Mathematically Gifted and Black, 